Hello there, welcome to another Skyrim Mod Showcase. Today, we will be doing the Flintlock Pistol. You can see its damage and weight and all that there, and uh, you can see that its specialty or its enchantment or whatever is a gunshot with a chance to instantly kill your target. So yeah, that's what we're looking at. Hold on, let me drop it and let you get a view of it. There we are, kind of glitching through the floor. I forgot how to pick things up. There we go. Yeah. Alright, well, it doesn't seem to be working too well. Anyway, let's go test it out on some enemies. I will see you there. Alright, we're back. Coming up on a bandit outpost, so let's test it out, shall we? Let's see, how do I sneak? Right there. Oh, missed him. Missed him. There we go, I hit him. Alright, well, let's get in closer because I'm pretty terrible at this. Not too bad. I like the sound of it. Now, as you can see, it doesn't do that much damage, but usually uh, you'll kill them instantly, like every now and then. It happens, you just have to keep shooting them. I mean, like I said, the damage isn't too much. Yeah, see, he died instantly. That was the uh, the enchantment for the flintlock pistol going on. What was that? They just die instantly. I also have the wolf sword, part of another mod, which we may be getting to sometime later. Don't know. Shot that guy in the face. Yeah, but I like the sound of this. This mod is completely not lore friendly, if you were curious. It's absolutely not lore friendly. It's a flintlock pistol. I don't think those were invented in the times of Skyrim. Time to end this little game. Oop. Yeah, I would say close combat. Uh, it's more effective than a bow and arrow, but you know, it's still not that effective. You should probably just use a melee weapon or something in close combat. But anyway, uh, it's a pretty good weapon. It doesn't do that much damage, but like I said, the insta-kill thing really makes a difference there. And the noise is pretty cool. I'd say it's uh, somewhat realistic, or as realistic as you could probably get in Skyrim regarding gunshot sounds. Because there are no guns in original Skyrim, or non-modded Skyrim. So, the noise is pretty good, like, for the fact that there aren't any gun sounds to go off of of uh, Skyrim, or in Skyrim. Overall, it's pretty fun. It's a pretty good mod. Um, I should mention, you can't buy it. You can only craft it. It takes uh, two silver ingots, two steel ingots, two pieces of firewood, and one Dwemer scrap metal. And then uh, you can make your own. I don't know if followers or companions will use it. I haven't tried it yet. They probably will, because it's, uh, it's pretty good damage. I think it'll probably do more damage than most of the uh, bows. So I'm pretty sure they would use it. But uh, anyway, that was pretty much the whole uh, the whole showcase here. Just showing you the pistol and testing it out a bit. But uh, yeah, I like it. It's pretty good. I would recommend it. It's a pretty uh, pretty fun way to change up the ranged combat in this game. Because I get a little tired of uh, bows and arrows. I don't know about anybody else, but I do. Run, little elk. <laughs> Deer. Yeah, deer. Oh, he died. Alright, well, uh, that was all. That was the Flintlock pistol. It is on the Skyrim Nexus, and it's a pretty small download, I believe. But anyway, that was all, and I will see you next time. Good day.